Hi, welcome to Robojax. In this video, I'm going to show you how we can use this uh, DHT22 uh, humidity and temperature module with TM1637 display to display the temperature like that. This value is in Fahrenheit. I will give you a code that you can get Celsius, Kelvin, humidity, and also heat index, all of those that is available with the library, so you can display it here. I'm now heating it up with a heater. So as you can see now, it shows a temperature in Fahrenheit now at three digits, so it can go up to four digits, which is enough for this application because this cannot display larger value. So let's get started. I have separate video for this display and TM1637, I have separate video for this one. So if you want to learn deeply more in detail about this or this one, watch my other video. The link also will be provided in the description. But here I'm gonna explain in simple way how to combine these two together. So the value from this uh, humidity and temperature sensor will be displayed here. You can get the code uh, by clicking at the link in the description, which will take you to robojax.com slash learn slash Arduino. So this display cannot display the decimal points because it doesn't have it. I didn't want to use this one because sometimes you will have three digits. So this will be rounded from float to integer to the nearest uh, value will be rounded. So this module has a clock digital out and out and VCC and ground. VCC will be connected to 5 volts, this will be connected to the ground and then the clock is connected to pin 2 and then data out and uh, data in out is connected to pin 3. So orange is to 2, white is to 3, so here they are connected here to pin 2 and to pin 3. Now the humidity and temperature sensor needs also 5 volts and this is a ground. The middle one is the data out. So this is connected, the black is connected to the ground because I have extra ground. But some of the Arduinos will not have two 5 volts and I didn't want to use another breadboard. So for simplicity, I've just set the pin 8 here as an output and I set it as high. So when you set the pin 8 as high, it will always give you 5 volts. So this uh, red is connected to pin 8, but that is for 5 volts. So you can connect wherever you want. This is to the ground. And pin middle one is connected to pin 9, where the data from the temperature sensor will be read here. From the top, I've put this uh, comment and then stars. So this is the beginning of team 1637 display and that is the end at the beginning of the code. So we have Arduino.h, this is for communication, this is for managing and all the features for the display. And that is a clock pin which is defined as pin 2 and data in out is pin 3. And we have one uh, second delay so test delay is the amount which will be used and here we are initializing the display so display with a clock that clock comes here and data out also will be here so this is the setup for the display and now from here to here this is a setup for the humidity and uh, temperature sensor so start of DHT code and end of DHT 22 code so you know it this is DHT dot h which is part of the library you have to watch my other video how you can add that and this is the pen 9 that is reading the temperature from this module and we have three four lines here so these are commented so this is commented for dh11 if ca in case if you're using it and this is 22 uncommented so there was something like this so remove that so that's uncomment, this is comment. So when you comment a line, it will be just uh, useless. It will be just omitted from the uh, execution. And now this value is tr transferred here. And then the type, which is this, will be transferred here. So this is as if we type DHT22 here. 
So this initializes the DHT object for the temperature. So that is the end. And then inside the setup, we have the serial monitor, which will display the code here on this screen. And this is a text that will display at the beginning. And then we set pin 8 as an output that is for the voltage of the sensor because we didn't need we didn't have extra 5 volts so as soon as we set that as an output and also we set pin 8 high so this will give 5 volts for the module and then we set DHT begin so this will begin uh, uh, reading the temperature so this is the setup setup is done now we go inside the loop so this is a delay that we set here because the uh, display cannot refresh that fast so we have to have some limitation and also the temperature module so after that from here to here this is the beginning of uh, the display uh, code and this is the end you do not touch it but for explanation, this sets the brightness. These are the value to set it clear, and this is clearing the screen. Every time the loop goes, it, it removes the previous value. And here, to get the value, we just use this function. So get temperature F, and it will print it on the screen. If you want to get centigrade, so that would be C. If you want Kelvin, just put Kelvin. If you want humidity, well, you will type H, and if you want heat factor, hu humidity, uh, index in Fahrenheit, or humidity index in Celsius, so you will do that. So this will give it to you, get temp, and this line, this is for displaying on this uh, serial monitor, but this line is very important. This gets the value, and we round it, because if you see here this will be rounded to 78 if it's above 5 so this one you see will be 78 now on the display because 77.9 the display cannot display the uh, decimal point so we are converting float rounding it and converting it into integer so now that integer so this temp is now the value and this line displays the text so if you type here 536, 536 will be displayed. But now we are putting the temperature here. And this 3 means this temperature will have three decimal, 3 digits. So that is the loop. And this, this method that we used, it has been explained greatly here. So all these values uh, are doing the job. So from here, get temperature to here it will just return the temperature for you for full detail please watch the other video because I don't want to waste your time here this shows now the humidity and per uh, percent so H here and just use H it will show you the humidity this now shows heat index in Celsius so just use H I C heat index Celsius if you want heat index in Fahrenheit H I F and both of this so this is for the display uh, for serial monitor this is for the display so this was how you could use this uh, display with humidity sensor thank you for watching please thumb up the video please share it and also subscribe i will have a lot of other cool projects coming soon